drinking a cool soda on the beach. Could you stop drinking for a second and help me get the fire lit? I am helping. I'm providing moral support. Oh, that'll motivate me all right. It'll motivate me to make the flames go higher and burn your portion of the meat. All right, all right, I'll help. Be careful not to get burned. Do you intend on helping us by any chance, Mary? Oh, heavens no. I have to be ready to take care of anyone who may get hurt. I guess that makes sense. We really shouldn't force a medical professional to work. I'll help. Oh, then can I stand back and provide moral support instead? I don't think so. <sighs> this doesn't seem to be going well. Patience is a virtue when it comes to fishing. How patient do I need to be? I've been waiting forever. Uh, maybe we'll catch something within the next two hours? <sighs> Can I at least take a nap while we wait? No, I can't touch fish, so I'll need you to grab them for me when something bites. of me. Why bother including these sour pusses? You can focus on me and get some great shots. Oh, oh I want to be in the photo too! <laughs> sure thing. We can take some photos together. <laughs> Yahoo! This is great! Does that sound good to you, honey? Oh, come now. Just look at them. They're on a pristine beach up on the surface, wearing sexy bikinis, and this is how they act? It's abundantly clear they have no intention of having any fun. Forget about them, and take some photos of me, alright? Viper, is it really necessary to be clinging to his arm as you're talking? Why do you care? You two look like you're attending a funeral. You're making Honey uncomfortable. Are you okay with Viper calling you, honey? Why would he have a problem with it? That's what he is. Oh. Hmm. Yes. What? Oh. Hmm.
I knew you would choose me. Are we going to play? Where you are? really want to have me by your side. Counselor, me. Do I have to? Unidentified armed groups are causing panic in the downtown area. The central government has identified the perpetrators as a terrorist group, and has announced they are preparing to suppress them. The terrorists are armed with the latest weaponry available, and the confrontation is expected to be tumultuous. Access to the downtown area has therefore been restricted. This isn't good. Not good at all. And now they're broadcasting it for all to see. Those fools. This will only make them more anxious. I don't think they wanted to drag this out anyway. But what they're doing now is goading us into action. I'll go buy us some time. For how long? Until the central government's lackeys come running? By the time the ACPU or Triangle gets there, it'll be too late. We have to apprehend them now. Alright. Then let's go. Stand down, Moran. I know how capable your subordinates are, but you're in over your head. These people are armed and dangerous. Those pea shooters of theirs don't stand a chance against me. The bullets will just bounce off me as I pummel them. <sighs> I implore you to reconsider. Think for a second. Do you want to advertise to everyone that you are a Nikkei? Oh, yeah, you're right. They're on the move. Hmm. It looks to me like they intend on taking hostages. What? They're getting civilians involved in this? Those cowards. I ought to... If they take hostages, that will complicate matters. It could lead to civilian casualties. I realize that. We have no choice. We have to wipe them out. You say we don't have a choice, but you seem awfully thrilled about it. Is this not the simplest course of action? It is. I'll give you that. Okay then. Let's go. Would you hold your horses for a damn minute? You can't go out there. Shouldn't a general be on the front lines of a skirmish? Why put yourself in harm's way when you can have your subordinates do the fighting? Ah, I get it. <laughs> you probably never considered that because you command too small a number. Hey, what are you implying? We can't get involved. If this gets out, we'll be in for a world of hurt. Moran, I have an important task for you. Stay by the back door and keep an eye out for any stragglers. If any of them manage to escape, things could escalate unnecessarily. Oh, okay. I'm on it. I trust that you'll do a fine job. I see you're quite adept at keeping her in line. Whatever do you mean? I don't believe that building has a back door, does it? Hmm. No matter, it would be best for her not to get involved in something this dangerous. True. All right, it's time we get into the thick of it. <laughs> Everyone, time to take out the trash. Multiple injuries were reported during a shootout in the Ark this afternoon around 3 p.m. Much to the relief of nearby residents, all injuries sustained were minor and no deaths were reported, including the terrorists. It is speculated that this incident was the result of gang rivalry. The reason for this speculation is due to footage captured by a journalist on the scene. Upon careful examination of the footage, two individuals can be seen. They are suspected to be the leaders of the organized crime groups Semakai and Hedonia. This is causing a huge... If only there was someone else to take my place. You gotta 
Ready for it? Kotodama, the power hidden within one's words! What? Let's play together! This is what you wanted. I... Did I do well? Both of your faces have been exposed to the media! Oh, mon dieu! At this rate, we won't be able to use the name Underworld Queen anymore. Mm, we might as well call you the Outland Queen! Don't get your knickers in a twist. So they saw our faces. What of it? No one will be able to connect us to this. In any way. It's not like we're the ones committing a crime. R right While I agree that we could have exercised more caution, the situation was critical. Every second counted. Yes, the fact we were photographed is a blunder on our part. But if you ask me, I don't find it to be a big deal. Our organization is well versed in covering up and rewriting facts. Exactly. My queens, you are sorely mistaken! Le public know what you look like now. You look like armed thugs in that footage. And say exactly what you're going to be perceived as. What are you talking about? Nothing's been confirmed yet. That's why you have to trust me when I say we've got it under control. The truth isn't what's important here. It doesn't matter in the slightest. They'll drag your names through the mud and spread calumny everywhere. And you want to know what will happen then? That deceitful slander will become la verite. In the minds of du public, they'll believe it as fact, even if they're not being present there with the entire picture. False rumors are something we can deal with. It's easy to put those to bed. Trebion. Then let's practice. Imagine on, I'm someone you meet while you're out and about. Wow, Nese Parozana. I saw you on TV recently. You're a gangster, right? So cool. That coat of yours must have cost a fortune. You probably won't got it by ripping someone off. You know that film producer from Tetra who went missing? I heard that you were the one who put the kibosh on her. Is that true? What the... What is this? I read an article on the internet where someone saw you walking outside. Lugging around in oversized suitcase. That's none of your business. Do you protest too much, perhaps? Should I take that as a yes? What are you talking about? Get lost. Hey, did you all hear that? She just told me to get lost! What in the world is going on here? I also read another article that said you're secretly meeting with a central government official. Are you two having a liaison clandestine? Or are you trying to curry favor? I bet I know a few ways that you attempt to do that. <laughs> That's enough. All right, I'll stop. But you must comprehend there that this kind of situation will occur on a daily basis. <sighs> the people will be misled by this muckwacking, and it will spur them into taking action against you. We cannot react, yet we also cannot sit by and do nothing. I think you're making mountains out of molehills here. I'd ask you to remember Pretty, the first idol the Ark ever had. Think about how she perished. Hmm. <sighs> We mustn't permit anything like that to ever reoccur. If they give us trouble, I'll rough them up and send them packing. 
So you're proposing we harm civilians? <sighs> I realize the gravity of the situation. We can go into hiding and lay low at the secret mansion. No. If we do nothing, Les Lunaires will only become more malicious and manifold. The most efficacious way to deal with such mendacity is to cover it up. Any bright ideas? Certainement! You three must remain out of sight, out of mind, but you must also actively suppress these rumors. I believe I can kill two birds with one stone. The key is for both of you to become magazine models! You two will partake in a photo shoot for my new magazine! Amor Petra! Once we've gotten some sizzling snaps of you two on the surface, we can publish them! And they'll <laughs> What? Huh? I'm ready to fight down and never let go! Don't rush it! I entrust this to you momentarily. See? I made it! No enemies left standing. I can see an island up ahead. Can we get something to eat first? I've been so nervous about this that I haven't eaten since yesterday. What should we eat? I'm good with anything. Meat! I want meat! Did you all cook up some barbecue last summer? We certainly did. Oh my goodness, that was delicious. You bet it was! And you know who you can thank for that? Neon, the god of fire. I handled all the cooking. You should have seen me. Even the god of the sea genuflected before me. I hope we get a chance to taste it as well. Well, it appears I have no choice but to unleash my secret skills once more. Hmm. Don't remember. Ugh. No. Yeah, they stirred up some major trouble, so they're getting sent to the beach. Ugh. <sighs> They'll be the models, and you can take the photos. Here, take this. Apparently the film is somewhat limited, so you have to be discerning when taking photos. I asked if we could use our phones, but they said that doesn't have the same feel. Anyway, Mustang said he would take care of everything else, so don't worry. He even scouted out a great location that you'll be going to. I wonder how he manages to get this all done so quickly. Mm. <sighs> uh, Cadet, you've got to help me. 
These two have been out of it ever since they were told about the photo shoot. Constantly belly aching about how this kind of thing is beneath the leaders of an organization like them. Help me cheer them up, will ya? I'm dying over here. Anyway, be sure to take the counters with you. It'll be on the surface, so it would be best to have a team of specialists on hand in case things go south. I bet lounging on the beach is something pretty much every Nikkei dreams about. Ah, oh, I want to go too. I'd much rather hang out by the sea than have to deal with all this underworld queen crap. If a certain two individuals hadn't made such a mess of things, I'd have been able to join you. Sorry. Sorry. Uh, huh? What are you two apologizing for? I thought you both were pissed off about all this. I'm sorry. Sorry. Uh, uh, what's gotten into you two lunkheads? I deserve to go up there more than either of you two. Hmm. Mm. Anyway, I've got to get going. There are a couple more people tagging along, and they'll be here soon. This is my cue to leave. Goodbye. Sorry, but seeing Rosanna and Sakura so apologetic is creeping me out. It's like I'm watching someone pretend to be them. Ugh. Gives me the willies. I'm out of here. Honey? Hey there, Commander. I decided to come along for the photo shoot. Me too! The boss recently started a magazine called Amor Tetra. And I was the cover model for the first issue. So, consider me an advisor. I'm here to offer some tips with photography, location scouting, and what kind of poses to go for. Not to mention, I'm getting a chance to see the ocean. This sounds like a dream. <laughs> I'll be assisting you both. I'll get to run around, carry heavy things, and eat delicious grub! <laughs> I figured Jackal would get a lot out of this, so I asked to bring her along. Thanks. Um... I've been told I'll be going as well. Hmm... Many of the people being sent on this mission have violent tendencies. And I've been tasked with putting a stop to any scuffles that may occur. Correct. We'll be heading into unknown territory. So... We may well encounter situations where physical strength is required. They're letting a known criminal from the rehabilitation center like you wander freely? I know her! She's supposed to be super strong! People say she can crush a rock with her bare hands! So what? You can do that too. I guess you're right. If I use my teeth, that is! Does that mean I'm strong, too? Of course it does. Hello, Command. <sighs> oh, wow. There sure are a lot of people here. Close your eyes, Jackal. Pretend you didn't see her. Alright. Who are you? The name's Maiden. 
I've been assigned as your security escort. Nice to meet you. Mr. Mustang requested that my boss have me come and keep an eye on Guilty. Not to mention Rosanna and Sakura. I doubt they'll cause any trouble, but you never know. I've also been assigned to protect you, so I have a lot on my shoulders. I got excited about getting to go to the beach. What about the counters? Mary is coming? Hey, that scary doctor is gonna be there too! So not only do we have two gang bosses in tow... Eek! We're also cavorting with a known criminal. Eek! There are only scary people! And now we've got a security guard keeping tabs on us. Eek! I'm glad you're not terrified of me, but that reaction was a bit... Commander, we'll be arriving soon. Oh my gosh, it's the ocean! The ocean! Come on, you guys! You too, Rappy! Quickly, quickly! <sighs> the ocean! The ocean! The ocean. <laughs> it's been a while. It feels just as wonderful as before. First things first, I'll locate a building that we can use as a clinic. We'll also proceed with our assigned tasks. Just a moment. What's gotten into you guys? We're at the sea, aren't we? The first thing we should be doing is changing into our swimsuits. I couldn't agree more! <laughs> You're right. It's been some time since we were here, so I suppose it slipped our minds. You wait here for a bit, honey. Uh, Viper, I didn't bring a swimsuit. What? Didn't I tell you to pack one? They're so uncomfortable. <sighs> You'd understand the appeal if there was someone you had feelings for. Feelings? I've got plenty of feelings! I like you, and I like Commander, too! <laughs> alright, alright. Can you at least help me put on my swimsuit? Sure! Um... Counselor... Should... I... Be wearing a swimsuit? As well? Hmm. You may have to help me put it on, since my hands are restrained. I need your help. Steady now, girly. I'll do it for you. But I don't trust you. Come on, don't be like that. You can trust me. Um, well, this is a bit awkward, isn't it? Don't feel like it. Me neither. You've already seen me in spicier clothes than that. So why make such a big deal about these stupid bikinis? Huh? I'm not quite following. What's Rosanna talking about? Um... Oh, right! I, er... Uh, I just remember that I left something somewhere else. I better go fetch it. I... I lived here in a previous life. My ancestors told me in a dream yesterday about a hidden item around here that'll boost my stats. Be right back.
<sighs> What's going on, mister? Why aren't you saying anything? Sorry to keep you waiting. I will show you the way of the Semakai. Let's keep it going. Coming up here, I'd have bought a new swimsuit ahead of time. Nah, this is for the best. You don't want to overspend. Commander, I've prepared a change of clothes for you. <sighs> I still say it would be nice if you helped me change, Counselor. Are those some kind of handcuffs you've got on? Yes. Aren't they uncomfortable? I'm used to it. Besides, I can take them off whenever I want. It's just that counselor prefers I keep them on. That way, he can do whatever he wants. <laughs> Come again? Oh, since my hands are usually tied behind my back. The counselor can do whatever he likes when we meet. Hmm. She has to be lying, right? Um, man oh man. It sure has been a while since I wore a swimsuit. Hey honey, check this out. Isn't it pretty? I got it especially for you. For your eyes only. <laughs> this swimsuit isn't even water resistant. It's just for show. When it gets wet, it becomes see-through. Would you like to see? Hmm. Hmm. I'll go change. Me too. Mister, come with me. Can you lend a hand? Mister, can you hold this for me? Take it. It's a gift. <sighs> this door doesn't lock. Could you hold the doorknob for me? Just hold it in place. Don't push it. Otherwise, it'll open. All done. I'm almost finished, too. Could you wait outside, mister? We'll be right out once we've finished up. Master? Why'd you come out alone? Could they be any more obvious? I'm about to go off. Obvious? About what? They're trying to get the commander to... 
Oh my! Those swimsuits look amazing on you. Mm. <sighs> How about we take some photos? I will show you the way of the Semakai. I entrust this to you momentarily. Sending my love. Mwah. Ready for it? May this radiant summer day remain beautiful. You touch what is mine, you will pay the price. See? I made it. No enemies left standing. This is quite the predicament. You were so gung-ho about getting changed a moment ago. Where'd all that enthusiasm go? Talk about the pot calling the kettle black. Now, now, ladies. We all have things to do. So instead of standing around bickering, let's get to work. Shouldn't we have something to eat first? All right. Now it's my time to shine. I brought plenty of things we can grill. Um... Can I go fishing? Fishing? Yeah. It's long been a dream of mine to go fishing. You know how to fish? I learned it from a game, so I should be okay. Right? Oh, I'm sure you'll be fine. I've got my gear all ready, so I'll head out. Can I... come... too? Hmm? Wouldn't it be better if I stayed with you? No. Mm. Right? Fine, let's go. Ah, nothing beats drinking a cool soda on the beach. Could you stop drinking for a second and help me get the fire lit? I am helping. I'm providing moral support. Oh, that'll motivate me, all right. It'll motivate me to make the flames go higher and burn your portion of the meat. All right, all right. I'll help. Be careful not to get burned. Do you intend on helping us by any chance, Mary? Oh, heavens no. I have to be ready to take care of anyone who may get hurt. I guess that makes sense. We really shouldn't force a medical professional to work. I'll help. Oh, then can I stand back and provide moral support instead? I don't think so. <sighs> this doesn't seem to be going well. Patience is a virtue when it comes to fishing. How patient do I need to be? I've been waiting forever. Uh, maybe we'll catch something within the next two hours. <sighs> Can I at least take a nap while we wait? No, I can't touch fish, so I'll need you to grab them for me when something bites. of me. Why bother including these sour pusses? You can focus on me and get some great shots. Oh, oh, I want to be in the photo too! <laughs> sure thing. We can take some photos together. Yahoo! 
Woohoo! This is great! Does that sound good to you, honey? Oh, come now. Just look at them. They're on a pristine beach up on the surface, wearing sexy bikinis, and this is how they act? It's abundantly clear they have no intention of having any fun. Forget about them, and take some photos of me, alright? Viper, is it really necessary to be clinging to his arm as you're talking? Why do you care? You two look like you're attending a funeral. You're making Honey uncomfortable. Are you okay with Viper calling you, Honey? Why would he have a problem with it? That's what he is. Oh. Hmm. Yes. What? I should have never agreed to this harebrained scheme. I am the leader of Hedonia, for crying out loud. What will my subordinates think of me plastered on a magazine cover in a swimsuit? I agree with Rosanna. There has to be another, more practical way of doing this. My thoughts exactly. I say we put an end to this and head back. I couldn't agree more. Don't you think you're being a little unreasonable? I don't care to hear your opinion on this matter. So pipe down. You think your feelings are all that matters? What about the others? Everyone is hesitant about cutting loose and having fun because of you two acting all miserable. Fire it up! No, not yet. My firepower sensor is telling me it's too early to put the meat on. The seasoning is done. We're ready to grill whenever. The sauce is ready as well. I... I've got something. I've caught it. I've only read about this, but now I'm feeling it in real life. Can I hold it? Sure, just don't grip it too tightly, or you might ruin it. Okay. Wow! Check it out, Viper! There's a whole bunch of falling stars here! Mmm. So much for everyone being too scared to enjoy themselves. Seems to me they're having plenty of fun. Uh, why don't we go join them? Wouldn't that be nice? It's not often you get a chance to fraternize with your fellow Nikkeis. Sorry, I'm not in the mood. The only reason we're all here is because of our foul up. For Sakura and I to be laughing and taking photos like nothing is wrong is... <laughs> What is this thing? It's not coming off. Calm down. If you pull too hard on it, the jellyfish might die. Then get over here and help me. I'm trying. <laughs> it's too slippery. It's impossible to get a grip on it. Screw this. I'm going to tear this thing apart. Huh? Out really well. <sighs> hmm. 
<laughs> you are really going through it. And look at you, acting all frantic. <laughs> so unlike you. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> How about surfing? I've always wanted to try that. I did go through the trouble of swapping my old body out for one which can swim, after all. I'm interested in building sand castles. Come on, let's take some photos. Sure, let's do it. You release me, I'll do as you say, counselor. Let's keep it going. I entrust this to you momentarily. It seems I will now be able to enjoy some quiet time with you. Alright everyone, listen up. When it comes to taking photos, the most important thing is the location. We're in the middle of a large archipelago composed of numerous islands. The environment is quite diverse. Choose your favorite spot and think about what kind of pictures you want to take. Got it? Dismissed. Commander, Anise, Neon, Mary and I are going to explore the island. It's a favor for Mustang. He asked us to survey Coral Island's ecosystem and determine whether it may be suitable for habitation should humans ever come up here. Agreed. While the chances of the Ark falling are slim, an island like this would make for an ideal replacement should that occur. It's surrounded on all sides by water and has an established ecosystem. Not only is it safe, it's also self-sufficient. No, you should focus on the original task assigned to you. For the sake of the Ark's safety, Underworld Queen's position must not be compromised. Completing that assignment is of vital importance. The Ark isn't going anywhere. Yes. One more thing. Exploration should be fun, so don't forget to enjoy yourself. See you. This is going better than I thought it would. Would you like to join, mister? Not yet. I need more practice. Wait until I feel ready. I will say I think this is the right place for my photo to be taken. I like that you'll be able to get a good view of the ocean. All right. I'm heading back in. After that whole song and dance about not wanting to come up here, and look at her now. She deliberately chose a swimsuit, changed into a body that was suitable for swimming, and even brought a surfboard. And did you catch a glimpse of Sakura's umbrella? Unbelievable. At 
at least they agreed to have their picture taken. To be honest, I was about to throw in the towel. this place special? Whew. I think I'm making progress. Hmm? What are you doing here? Mm. I was looking for a good spot. To get my photo taken. Don't even think about it. I've already got dibs on this place. What are you talking about? You snooze, you lose. Let's see... How about... there? I presume you're going to head back in for more surfing practice? Yes? What a shame. As for me, I'm ready to go. So I can be photographed anytime I want. And anywhere I want. Hmm... Mister... Don't you dare take her photo. I mean it. Honey, take a picture of me. Just kidding. <laughs> I only wanted to tease her a little. You ought to go explore some other areas. I'm gonna stay here and watch her surf for a bit longer. You must be joking. Do I look like some kind of beach bum? You know how I love physical activity. Hold on. Could it be you just want to see me all wet in this swimsuit? <laughs> Pushing your buttons is a real riot. You know that? Now, Guilty! Pull back! How do I do that? Like... this? Oh, this fishing rod is awfully weak. I barely tugged on it, and it broke. It's okay. I brought a few spares. What a bummer, though. I think you had a real catch on the line. Mm. Can't we simply catch them with our hands? Is that even possible? <clears throat> sure it is. Watch. Whoa. You're pretty good. Still, I'd say there's a limit on the size of fish you can catch if you use your hands. If you want the big boys, you've got to use the fishing rod. It's like any video game. If you fish with an SSR fishing rod, you're more likely to catch legendary fish. I'm sure I'll be able to catch a whopper with this rod. I'm pretty sure I'd be able to catch them with my hands. Alright then, I have a proposition. Let's see who can catch the bigger fish. You want to have a competition? That's right. Fine. Hmm. What kind of fish should I be aiming for? How about a great white shark? They must be. This is the ocean after all. What was it again? A swordfish. They occasionally appear as bosses in the fishing minigame of Final Quest. Very well. I'll catch one with my hands. And my hands alone. Hmm. I'll prove that the fishing rod is the only way to snag these big fellas. Using your hands is far faster than depending on a fishing rod.
I won't lose. Me neither. Oh, I can feel a big catch coming on. Not if I catch it first. No, it's not here either. The book said that this time they're most active in this area. But I don't see a single one. Has too much time passed? Is it already my turn to take a picture? Have you taken a lot of pictures of others? Not a single one? Did you say, Great White Shark? I see. Well, there's no need to rush. We still have plenty of time. <sighs> For me, it's not about the location. Rather, there's something I'd like to have my photo taken with. Well... A photo shoot. I'm not really into that sort of thing, but... <sighs> to be able to go to the seaside with... Hmm, what's this? What a silly story. There's no such thing as a pink dolphin, surely. It's just... I feel a bit silly admitting what it is, because what I'm looking for might not actually exist. Hmm? Aren't you curious to know what it is? Help me with my search? Even if you don't know what it is I'm looking for. I see. You're such a kind person. I'm merely stating the obvious. How about you come with me? When I find it, I'll have you take a photo. I will show you the way of the Semekai. The heat is rising. I'm trembling. Go to hell, scary monsters. 
The heat is rising. I entrust this to you momentarily. Um, did you hear that? I thought you'd tuck yourself out by now. You're still going strong. I told you. I don't intend on losing. Oh, hey, Commander. Where are you? Swordfish. That can wait. As you can see, I'm rather busy right now. And besides, I have a very specific idea of how I want my photo to turn out. I want to take a photo with the Great White Shark. <gasps> I was thinking the same. Well, I'm sorry to break it to you, but that's not gonna happen for you. Because I'm going to be the one who catches the Great White Shark. Excuse me? I feel like giving a nice... big... hug. Ugh, sorry, but I'd rather you not. Give the commander a hug instead. Hey now, let's not get carried away here. <laughs> I think you deserve a nice big hug as well, Counselor. That's it. It's high time I catch this fish and show you what for. Commander, since you're here, could you hand me some of that bait behind you? I don't want to take my eyes off my fishing rod, not for a second. Hmm? Does using bait make it easier to catch fish? Shouldn't that be obvious? Just like we can't resist certain aromas, like, say, freshly baked bread, fish can't resist the smell of bait. And this isn't your ordinary run-of-the-mill bait. This is special. With this stuff, you could catch every last bit of marine life in this ocean. Every one? I don't need to rely on such... chicanery. In that case, could I borrow some of the bait? Why? Hold up. Huh? Are you interested in the Great White Shark as well? What? Has another competitor entered the ring? It's not that, it's... Hmm. <sighs> Maybe something like that. It's that there's something specific that I'm looking for. The only thing is that I don't know if it actually exists or where it lives. So, I was hoping I could have some of Maiden's special bait to maybe lure it to me. Ah, uh, I gotcha. You want to confirm if this thing really exists? It's kind of like when you're farming in a game and you don't know where a good item may be located. So you have to check every nook and cranny in order to satisfy your curiosity. What you're doing is something that I can get behind. But I don't think I can spare any of this bait. I need it for my own purposes. Oh, you do? Instead, let me tell you something even better. I'll give you the recipe to make a special bait that no aquatic life form could possibly resist. <sighs> Here, let me give you the recipe. I've got it written down somewhere. Take this, too. That stuff will attract fish like nobody's business. Once our underwater friends catch a whiff of that, they won't be able to pass it by. I made it. 
Yep. I went off information that I gleaned from a couple of games. I put all the ingredients back in the ark and whipped up this little concoction before we came here. Of course. There have been plenty of times when the info I've gleaned from games has helped me in a pinch. This stuff is identical to what I used in a game to catch a great white shark. Oh right, one more thing. Why are you giving this to me? If you toss the bait out with your hands, you're not liable to get it out very far. Sure I could. How would you know? You've never even used it. Because... I don't need it. If you attach the bait to this fishing rod and give it a good toss, you'll be able to get it fairly far out there. Make sure to use it wisely. I see. Thank you. I'll make good use of it. One more piece of friendly advice. After you cast, you ideally want to bomb the line to and fro, in a rhythm. Why is that? It is said that it intrigues the fish and makes it easier to hook them. Naturally. There's a lot you can learn from that game. In fact, I've got a few more tidbits of advice from it. If I want to find what I am looking for, I might need to make the bait Maiden told me about. Would you walk with me to the beach? Huh? What even is that? It does live in the sea, but it's not what you just mentioned. Hi there, honey. Perfect timing. I was just about to go looking for you after a few more snaps. Rosanna and I are in a bit of a face-off right now. You know how Rosanna and I were arguing about who could get their photo taken here. In the end, we couldn't reach an agreement, so we decided to have a little contest. Each of us will take some photos on our phones, and whoever gets the better shot... wins. Naturally, I imagine I'll be able to beat Rosanna without much effort. But you never know. So I was taking some practice snaps before getting my photo taken by you. Do you want to see the angle that I got here? I think it'd look good if you could emulate the same composition. Huh? Sakura? What are you two doing together? It's here to take photos, and I'm looking for something. So, we're walking together. Ah, got it. For a second I almost mistook it for a date. In that case, do you mind if I borrow him for a while? No problem. I'll be fine. I've got the instructions Maiden gave me. Viper! Oh. I brought back a whole bunch of big 
like leaves! Nicely done. Put some under the hammock and prop the rest up. Got it! She's got nothing better to do, so I told her to bring me some palm leaves that I could use as a prop. Better than her sitting around eating sand like she was doing. Besides, she's here as my assistant. I set them under the hammock like you said. Do you want me to hold up the others like this? A bit higher. Like this? A bit more. A bit... more? Good. How does it look? Does it look good? Be sure to make me look good. Jackal, keep that leaf held high, you hear? <laughs> Hurry up, Commander! <laughs> what the? Where's all that smoke coming from? world is she up to now? What would she possibly be cooking? Did you get the photo all sorted? No, we didn't. Thanks to all this smoke you're kicking up. I'm following the instructions to make the bait. Bait is supposed to lure in fish, right? I figured, wouldn't it taste better if it's cooked? Oh, really? I didn't know. Are you kidding me? You're so used to having your subordinates do everything for you that you don't have any common sense left. <sighs> that smells delicious. Can I have some? Sure, go ahead. I've got plenty more. Thanks! <laughs> Yuck! That's disgusting. will be the nastiest thing I've ever tasted. Ugh. I don't feel so good. My head hurts. And my stomach, too. You okay, Jackal? What on earth was in that stuff? I think I'm gonna barf. Honey, I've gotta take Jackal over to see Mary. Let's take the photo later. <sighs> I will fulfill my duties. I entrust this to you momentarily. I'm fine. I just feel sorry for Jackal. Let me see. Hmm. Rafflesia saliva, flamingo claw, and white coral horn. I managed to get some jellyfish armor from Maiden earlier, so we're good there. I'm having quite the time tracking down these other three items, though. Master! Master! I just found something incredible! Come and check it out! Huh?
Isn't that incredible? These birds only have one leg! What a marvel of nature! <sighs> huh? Why on earth would you need that? It's a long story, but I assure you that it's vital. I'm begging you for help in this matter. I'm not entirely sure what's going on, but I'm more than happy to put my skills to good use and extract a claw for you. <sighs> I don't think you have to pull one out. thanks to my superior fighting skills. I'm sure you've heard of a samurai who could catch a flying blade in midair? You certainly caught it, all right, with your entire body. Here you go, Master. This is for you. As for me, I'm gonna continue exploring this place. around there. Also, there was some white coral on the beach. Would you like me to draw you a map? Cartography is a skill every spy worth their salt knows. If you could, that'd be great. Rising. Ugh, so annoying. Um, did you hear that? Hello, you two. What's that you're holding? Is it white coral? Finding coral that's naturally white is quite a rarity. Are you going to use it for decoration? It's a special material for a special purpose. Oh? You do know that that coral contains poison, right? These kinds of toxins are no joke. If you were to get stung by that or something like a sea urchin, the treatment process would be very long and very painful. <laughs> oh yes, she just ate too much sand, that's all. She's perfectly fine now and running around like she always does. <laughs> I haven't experienced any issues thus far from exploring the island. This would be a fine place to live. I'd love to stay a bit longer if possible, but... Oh, right. Have you ventured into the jungle yet? We found it while out exploring and saw an absolutely massive flower there. I haven't been there yet, but I was planning on going soon. You should go and take some photos there. 
Anise and Rappy should be there as well. I'm okay, thanks. Last summer was the best summer of my life. I already know that nothing will surpass that. So instead of trying to replace those memories, I'm content holding on to them as is. That seems oddly sad to me. <laughs> then you guys will have to hurry and reclaim the surface. I think that's the only thing that would be an improvement over last year. Well, see you at dinner time. By a flower. She said something in the flower's mouth was moving, and when she leaned in for a closer look. Ugh, it's so slippery and slimy in here, and there are dead bugs everywhere. Get me out of here! Okay. I'll provide cover while Sakura opens fire. That was horrible! I nearly lost my lunch! All the slime and the bugs and that horrible stench! Ugh. I'm going to collect a sample. This stuff might be poisonous. Hmm, seems okay. How do you know? Are you some kind of ninja who knows poisons? As a matter of fact, yes. Show me your ninjutsu then. I'm afraid I haven't gotten quite that far. Ugh, gross! This stuff is congealing! I've gotta wash this off me pronto! That's probably a good idea. Oh my gosh, Anise! What happened to you? And what's that rank odor? Actually, you tend to smell kind of funky anyway, so that makes sense. Where did you come out from all of a sudden? And why are you picking a fight? Sure. See you then. The special bait is complete. Got to hang it on the hook. And now, all we do is wait. We should have asked Maiden how long we should expect to wait. You're right, we do. Since when were you into fishing? What are you trying to catch? What are you two doing here? I saw you two hanging out together, and it caught my attention. It got me wondering what kind of fun you both were up to. <laughs> you were wandering all over the island, but didn't seem to be looking for a good photo spot. Instead, you appeared to be busting your hums attempting to collect a few things. I wonder what it could be. Could you excuse us for a moment? And I have some important business to attend to. Sorry, but I'm perfectly comfortable right here. Same here. In that case, I'll... Mo Someone else to take my place. Ah! 
I entrust this to you momentarily. Let's keep it going. Hey, calm down. See? I made it. No enemies left standing. So they do exist. They're so beautiful. Their coloring is exquisite. Yes, that's right. I've never seen one before either. Probably, since they're so rare. Oh no! They left before I had the chance to get a photo. You're right. We can call them back with the bait. Turns out this stuff is effective after all. Wow, pink dolphins! How lucky are we to catch a glimpse of them with our own eyes? Hey, you guys want to know something? There used to be an old legend that if you took a photo with a pink dolphin up on the surface, all your romantic desires would come true. <sighs> hmm. Hmm. My oh my, Sakura. I'm impressed. I hadn't picked you for the mushy type. You pretended to be all refined and professional, when in reality, this is what you were up to? How come? Who do you have the hots for so bad that you're on the hunt for a pink dolphin? Tell me. Um... Mm. Viper, you win. You can take a photo with the sea in the background. I'll take a photo somewhere else. Seriously? Woohoo! However, I just realized what kind of photo I want to take. Hmm? That's right! <laughs> if you two are planning on trying to get a picture of the pink dolphin, don't even think about it. The pink dolphin belongs to me. How come? I'm the one who called them over. Wow. So now you've mastered the ability to summon animals? Is that a technique handed down in the Simakai? That's right. Hmm. So that's why you were exploring the island? Looking for ingredients to make some kind of bait? Is that what's inside that bottle? No. No? Then you won't mind if I take some. That's my property. Keep your hands off it. Nobody is allowed to touch my things. Don't make me say it twice. Hmm. Allow me to remind you of something as well. If I want something, I take it. By any means necessary. That's how I roll. Yes. Everyone has their own way of doing things. It seems to me that we're at a bit of a stalemate. Sounds like there's only one solution to this problem. Hmm. Hmm. Are you guys... fighting? <sighs> what the... when did you get here? You surprised me. Don't fight. We all need to try and get along. Oh, this is perfect. This will make a fine fishing chair. No, what was I saying? Oh, right. Less fighting, more getting along. Okay. Ugh. See? 
I made it. No enemies left standing. Rosanna? How long do you plan to continue following me? Following... me? You've got it all wrong. I'm simply taking a walk. Then, if you don't mind, could you walk ahead of us? Now, now. Don't rush me. I'll walk at my own pace. Thank you very much. <sighs> Despite how banal it may seem, shadowing someone is in fact a high-level skill which demands expertise. It keeps your opponent on edge, all without you having to make a move. It's not overly aggressive and doesn't cause any outright harm, yet drains your opponent's mental fortitude. Your opponent can't lower their guard for an instant, nor can they retaliate. It's a long-standing and sophisticated method of intimidation used by Hedonia. When she said she'll use any means necessary to get what she wants, she meant it. That's what is both frightening and admirable about Rosanna. I don't have a fraction of her resolve. Sakura! Sakura! Jackal? What's wrong? You said you had something to give me? Huh? Viper told me that you had something cool for me! Oh. <sighs> what about this? Ooh, so pretty! Is it true that you caught a turtle that's four meters? How is that possible? There's no way a beginner could pull that off. I mean, I know I'm kind of a beginner myself, but still. Who told you that? V viper She had to have been lying, right? There's no way that's true, is it? Yes. Sounds to me like she's been spreading falsehoods. Sakura! Viper told me that you'd injured your leg. Are you okay? Hey, did you steal my sodas? You're the leader of an entire gang. You should have enough money for your own. And you hid the lens clock for my glasses. <sighs> Isn't the weather lovely? <sighs> That's all the bait I had. Now, please, let me be. I have to say, I almost feel bad. I certainly did not go on a walk expecting this to happen. But thank you anyway. Yeah, thanks a bunch. I'm glad we came to an agreement. I'm tired. I just want to get my photo taken so I can rest. That spot over there by the Kraken-shaped rock should do fine. Go right ahead. You have my permission. <laughs> yeah, go for it. Yeah, I'm satisfied with briefly joining in the excitement of that legendary sight. see something further inside. It looks like a cave. Will you come with me? No, are you? Let's keep going. Look. A 
over there. The way we came is completely submerged now. It must flood when the tides come in at night. This isn't good. No. We're stranded. Listen to me. We are stranded. We will have to spend the night here. You and I. Just the two of us. So, come sit next to me. ourselves some luck. See? I made it. No enemies left standing. 